Hey everyone, it's Davil. It is a really, really hot and muggy day out here in New Delhi, India. Uh, I'm over here by the presidential palace here in the background. This is where the president of India stays. And uh, my understanding is, is that when a lot of foreign dig dignitaries come, uh, they come over here to visit with the prime minister and all the other Indian government officials. Uh, I'm over here right now with my my tour guide. Can you say hi? Hi. Can you say your name and everything here for my friends? Uh, my name is Faraz. Faraz ji, can you tell us a little bit about the presidential palace and, and uh, the sure. history behind it very quickly? Sure, sure. Why not? So we are the palace. You are looking the behind us. That's the, the biggest president palace. It's an old time. It's a call of the Viceroy Palace. That palace have over 100, more than 140 rooms. And for the services, definitely have a lot of the people. So it will be more than 2,400 servants there. Wow. And this is all built by the British, is that right? Yes. These are all the area. This will be in the present palace. And uh, our, my right hand side, that will be there. Have, uh, this will be the south block. And the front of the south block have the north block. So north, south, and the present palace, India. These are whole areas completely construction by British. And this place here, it's a design, not like the Indian designing, it's a combined. Most of the, when we have to look in the first sizes, look like a European, Roman architecture. It is a bit true, because the architecture is not from India, it's from Europe. Yeah, that's, which that's, place of Europe? That's the place called, uh, it's be Italy. It's very, it's very interesting here, because when you look at the architecture, it does have a little bit of an Indian flair, if you will, but... Uh, most of the architecture here is uh, is uh, is European and everything. And if you look closely here, at one of the buildings, you'll actually see a, a, a British monarchy sign or something. So the Brits thought they were going to be here forever. But uh, just wanted to give you guys a shot of this. I'm going to shoot a pan here and then sign off. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, namaste. Namaste.